them. It's me. The masks are down. Ho opono pono. I'm sorry. Forgive me. Thank you. I love you. Thank you. May 13, 2020, video testimonial number five after the Holy Spirit entered my vessel just through making a simple phone call. For those who commented that I sound like Dr. Seuss, I take that as a compliment. Dr. Seuss, Dr. Seuss's books gave me great joy as a child, even gave me humor in my dark hours of gang stalking crap, like sneeches and snitches end up in ditches. Well, I am a truth teller and I was the one that almost ended up in the ditch. Remember that? You were with me, Steve. Normally you dry, drove and I ended up driving that day and I was in Ridgeland, South Carolina when a big truck almost ran me off the road into some cement slabs. Princess Diana comes to mind. She was gang stalked, murdered. There was a cop car behind me who saw everything and the cop proceeded to follow me. Deep state of South Carolina was the worst area to live. I could feel the oppression, domination, sorrow in the land. Literally, I could feel the sadness in the land, what went on there years ago. Oh my gosh, it was, will rock your soul. Um, it's beautiful, you know, low country. Low country is beautiful living, but not if you're one of those takers and you're not giving. I worked for the fanciest of places. I know I upset their control grid by going to all these places. I've been serving love all over the place, just like mom. Ramshorn Country Club in Michigan, Rafferty's Dockside in Michigan, Boca Point Country Club in Florida, Rebels French Country Restaurant in Ashland, Oregon during the Shakespeare Festival. Made bank to get to Ninoli, served the family of Soma and Julie at that time, um, and all their beautiful childrens that were there. Tendavi Kealohi Oka Keahau. Don't ask me how. <laughs> I remember walking around with that little one with the, picking the edible flowers for the salad. <clears throat> so lovely. And lastly, that the historic Atlantic Hotel in Berlin, Maryland, which brings me to Theran Theran. I was the one who told him about, please don't say the F word around me. But he also had to remind me of his name. It's not Theran, it's Theran. So I hope I didn't uh, mess his name up in my last video. It took me a long time to get to where I am. And without mom, pa, God, I would be dead now. I mean, I'd already be dead, seriously. I looked Lucifer straight in the eyes, I guess, and he kicked my ass. I came home from Hawaii with a bunch of, you know, some wounds that you couldn't see and some that you could. Anyways, I am willing to share my story, um, hoping it will help all of you. I have been on an accelerated path of growth and learning since I was two or before. Um, this is what I tell my daughter, Sienna Catherine, to help her get through these extremely difficult times being away from her mama. I told her that she chose to be on an accelerated path of growth and learning when she chose me as her mom and who she chose as her dad, you know, as earth parents. So now I'm planning my pilgrimage and preparing my vessel to see my galactic mommy, mother of all creation and pa. And I got to tell you, she's not in the best condition. Her body reflects what all her children have done to her. She has been beaten up and even worse. I mean, I won't go into the details. You can research it and feel your way through that yourself. But I felt it in this life, actually, I feel. Currently, she is paralyzed from her chest down. Father carries her all around, you know, to the bathroom and such. So now is the, the time to kick your own ass and say thank you very much, Mom and Pa. Thank you for coming to rescue us. Free will was a flop. Surrender to divine will like me and Mom and Pa are coming for you in love. Open your eyes and see. Yeah, free will was a flop. The children couldn't find their way back home. But there are some that are like ready and know. They're hearing the call right now. Oh, well, I felt them coming for me. I was triggered by PG's voice. He said the name Pam, but wasn't referring to me. However it worked, it triggered me. Also, the F word was triggering for me. 
I was on the fence about this family. They seemed really cool and hip, you know, hippie, but kind of like a pirate-ish thing too. <laughs> I, forgive me, I don't know. Um, but as I listened more and more, the frequency got to me in my heart. Um, and pirates steal, so they're not a pirate family. We're, they, they're going to give us everything back. That's what they're here to restore order. So if you want peace, love, and harmony and balance, then this place is where we start together. So, well, I heard the truth. And the F word language was a test for me personally. Maybe it is for you too. Don't judge. Would you know divinity if it slapped you in the face and said the F word? Test, test, test. Let's pass all of these last tests with flying rainbow fucking colors. Woo! No. Now, one thing my Native American brethren family have taught me was if I say anything good, it's God talking. If it's not good, it's me talking, you know? So I'm still working on my divinity and nobody is perfect, only mom and pa. Um, we strive to be like our parents, albeit unattainable. Speaking of striving, I went diving into the above ground pool, soul blue, you see. I love water. I intend to be in and around water. Well, not a great idea when you're still in diapers and didn't have swimming lessons as a baby like my daughter did in Florida. And I wanted that underwater birth. Anyways, that's another story. I climbed up on the filter of our above ground pool and everything was blue, then black, then quiet. Then my brother Tim was the first brother to rescue me. I had two. Philip rescued me too from the ice. Kelly Walters was there. She saw me fall through the ice. Um, anyways, he saw my diaper floating, my head underwater, of course. The next thing I know, my dad gave me mouth to mouth and I came back around and said, Daddy, I choked. Oh, that's my near-death experience. The first one. Thank you, Ma Pa, for rescuing me from this dense third dimensional reality. Papa asked an assignment of me. Well, all of the children... Oh, oh, sorry. He asked it of all of us children. Call people out. I am calling out the sister who owns this shirt. See that shirt? <laughs> As you know... As you know, most all of my clothes have been given to me by somebody, a lot from Sherry. Well, I have your shirt. What are you going to do? Call first fractal ground crew. I love you. This sister already picked up on the feeling because she finally decided to comment and show me that love and feeling. You know truth, girl. I know your money situation too. It will be all worked out. Just call now the first Fractal Galactic Ground Crew. I haven't sent any money yet. I mean, I have $16 or like the crispest bills and they need to get in the mail today and I have a lot to do, which brings me to ET phone home. Oh, oh, that brings me to say that my lesson is for me to slow down a little bit in what I'm doing. Yours might be to pick up the pace. It's, you know, you work that out with the creator. And she's here and he's here and thank God. Oh, God's a woman, mother of creation, you see. Great white buffalo calf pipe woman. We'll go into all this. It's going to be fun, you and me. Um, also, if I've said anything to offend anyone for any reason, I apologize. That wasn't my intention. I am coming straight from my heart to your heart in genuine authenticity. This is what the Holy Spirit has done for me. It's as simple as one, two, three, except you better get the correct phone number or you might be calling Italy. Once again, I have dropped everything to put mom first and get out this message. Sometimes that hurts the worst. There's so much more I want to share, but as always, I am in service to those around me and who need my help, like Ancient of Days and Aunt Dee, me mom, me daughter. For goodness sakes, I have an airplane hanger to paint because I needed to help, uh, you know, gain money for back taxes for this house. Thank you, Ancient of Days. Thank you, Aunt Dee. I enjoy painting and the weather is beautiful. I feel like I have been multitasking for a long time now 
And finally, it's time to say, wow, Ma and Pa are back on the planet and the hamster wheel of the pamster has come to a grinding halt. Open up the vault of your heart and call home. No blame, no shame. Just sit and let it drain. Just kidding. <laughs> know thyself, know thy game. Love has won. Love has won. <sighs> na, 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 na. Hey, 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 love is one. Oh, let me, this quote is from Cheryl Benson. Don and Cheryl Benson have made the invention for all of us to play Eclipse Ball as, as the youngest to the oldest can play Eclipse Ball. But she gave me this jacket one time and I was wearing a rainbow skirt and she said, I have a jacket for you. Well, look at this coat of many colors. I love it. Thank you. The other thing I wanted to mention was this was what I wore when I went and held up the sign. I didn't have a lot of time because I was still, I was doing everything on my own. Mom, I understand how you feel like that. I felt so alone and everything, making signs to go to DC. I drove there by myself. I drove back. I did this. I did that. But this is not done yet. But this was supposed to be like the Phoenix Rising symbol white dove. And I put the cuffs on and did a little bit down here. This lace came from Lucci. She knows who she is. Lucci from Florida. Lucci Seifa had to go back to Albania with her family and she left a lot of stuff behind. I tried to salvage it. I even sent her her jewelry and stuff that she left in the corner closet, whatever. But this is from her, her. Thank you, Lucci. I haven't forgotten you, honey. I felt a connection with you right away, right away. And then for all of those targeted individuals out there, this stuff is real. I went to DC about it and you know, you know, the CIA's Operation Mockingbird will know our disinformation program is complete when everything the American public believes is false. And we're at that point, people. We're at that point where um, people are just believing everything that, you know, they're being told. you got to reclaim your brain, you know, because you've been bamboozled. And we'll go over all this, but just make your phone call home, please, because it's time. We're overdue. You know what I was told? You're tardy, but not too late. I don't like to be tardy. I've, I'm having a hard time with time, but this is like, drop everything. Don't forget to uh, live stream tonight at six, Michigan time, Eastern Standard time would be six. They're on mountain time. Mountain mama, take me home to the place I belong, West Virginia. Mountain mama. Take me home, away from the criminals in action, because that's all they do. They're fear-mongering you, and then they're siphoning your energy, too. I mean, that's all they do. Okay, so it's time to step up to the plate so we can all get this done. You got to get online. You got to call. It's all coming together. We're in this together. 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 Forever. You and me. Together. Forever. Can't you see? I hope you do because I feel like I'm being really silly to try to get people to wake up. Wake up. It's, it's time to wake up. It's time to wake up. Imagine that as your alarm clock. You want me to keep saying that over and over? Because I'll be one of those children that pester you. I'll pester because I'm paying the pill. Now I got to get going. I have a lot to do. I'll see you later. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Pa. I got all, almost everything out of my craw. Love you.